He gonna be so mad. What the holy shit? All righty, boys. Let's see what it is. All right. Uh, the time has come, Warrior of Light. We must war move against the Warring Triad now or suffer the consequences. The seal is cracked and the icons stir. Should they be awoken, uh, allowed to awoken and resume their titanic conflict, it will be like the coming of a second calamity. You, Asmongold, represent our best hope at eliminating this threat. That said, the very act of entering a containment facility itself uh, presents certain unique challenges. So unique, in fact, that I struggled to locate an individual with the requisite talents to surmount them. But we must also uh, wear the interference of those who covet the Allagan's primal harnessing technology. I speak, of course, of those blindly grasping of the hand of the Garlean Empire and its fumbling ancients, or sorry, agents. True. The ignorant meddling of the Empire will serve only to hasten the Icon's awakening, and it is my master's desire that the Triad be dispatched before the Imperial forces delve too deeply. Make your preparations and join me at the flagship of Alice Law, and we shall speak further there. Fuck yeah, let's do that. Your adversary is the Icon Sephiroth of the Warring Triad, otherwise known by the historians of Allag as the Fiend. He was once the patron deity of a tribe of tree-like beings native to Mercadia, but was subdued by the Allegan Empire after a lengthy war of attrition. After his defeat, he was imprisoned for the use of his power. Even now, Sephiroth is neither truly living or dead. His mind bound in a dream while his body emerges and is harnessed by the Allegan technologies. The explanation for his failure to dissipate into the ether lies entirely in his restraints. These ingenious devices serve not only to bind him, but to continuously regenerate his corporeal form. It's time that I had a little chat with the doorkeeper over there. Where's she gonna go? Hello, ball? I like how it's like massive, you know, like crazy technology that has like, you know, spaceships floating in the sky and shit like that. And the door to Sephiroth is just, it, it's got chains over it because they don't want the, the, they don't want people to open the door because it's chains, you put chains on the door, right? Beep bloop. Warning, verification systems detect multiple unauthorized vessels entering unrestricted unrestric airspace, security systems engaging intruders. The Garleans come over danger, we must keep the Imperials occupied. Okay. The fuck that's about me, dude, what the hell? Oh, men eye level? Yeah, we're gonna do it on men eye level. We're gonna do all the trials from now on on men eye level. What is this? Oh my god, that's a big boy. Oh my god, that's a big one. Disabling Sephiroth's restraints now. Good luck. Good luck. He gonna be so mad. What the holy shit? This is like a fucking bro. This is like my champ on steroids. So here's what we do. Uh, I'm gonna pull the boss. Uh, we'll probably need six tanks, one for each arm. And um, other than that, I feel like uh, everything else should be fine. Uh, we just go ahead and we we start attacking him and we beat him. Okay. Good job, boys. Keep it up. Just don't let me die. Holy shit. This guy's doing a lot of damage. Oh, boy. All right, all right, all right, all right. Everything's okay. No reason to worry. Okay. 80%. Let's go, guys. Stay focused. Okay. That seems like it's not good. Okay, I don't know what else I expected. But yeah, all right, when he raises his hand up, he's gonna do a tank buster. Wow, I could have never guessed that. Okay, spread out, boys, spread out. That's green shit. Yeah, there, good job. Okay, 
75% already. 75%. Good job. Okay, just... All right, yeah, we just don't want to be in front of him. That's easy. Good. Res our healer. Let's res our healer. Yep, let's get that healer up, boys. It's not a big deal. It'll be totally fine. Got to get that healer up. Got to get that healer up, boys. Let's go. We stack on that. Stack on that. Stack on that. Good job. Great job. Good job. Great job. Good job. Okay, I'm going to just pop a... All right, there we go. And I'm going to go ahead and just pop this CD for it. I really like this mechanic. I like that so much. That's so cool. You actually just watch him do it. Okay, um... Coochie Mama. We got to kill, kill Coochie Mama here. Let's go. Good job. Good job. All right, good. I'll face this one away. Okay, he's not even doing anything else right besides that. Okay, just more ads there. Remember, stay, don't be in front of him. He does like a cleave, I think. Okay, good job. Great job. Absolutely good job. All right, another one. Okay, Magi's got it. That's fine. Doesn't matter to me. Okay, I, I just picked up aggro. It's fine. Doesn't matter. Okay, we're just kind of trading back and forth. Patience and patience. I'm winning. I've learned to enact this vengeance. What the fuck? Okay. That's not a big deal. He's dead. We got him. All right. Uh, what? Okay, do we move over to the other side, I think? No, we don't. Holy shit. All right, res me. How am I supposed to know where that's going to hit? Go for it, boys. You got it. I have no fucking idea how that works at all. Yeah, I wish I knew. Okay, that's where I say stack up. Stack up, boys. Stack up, boys. Stack up. Get in that. Get in that. There you go. Nice job. And then, oh, he does a, he does a sweep. 36%. This is an easy kill, guys. Easiest kill of my life. Great job. Everybody's alive. We're doing just, we're doing just fine. Okay, here we go. And this is the sides, right? Yeah. Wow. Good job, guys. Good work. Good teamwork. Keep it up. Keep it up, boys. You got it. Really good job, boys. Really good job. Great work. Great work. Insane. Super proud of you guys. Wow. It's too bad that we uh, that I died there. I couldn't get res. It sucks. I had no idea what was going to happen. It sucks I died, dude. What the fuck? What the fuck? You did it. You're right. I did it. Yoshlada, this is Kriel. Icon eliminated. If only you could have seen it. Asmund Goldgate, Sephiroth, the mother of all rude awakenings. Very true. Wow. Why are they singing my praises so highly right now? I feel kind of awkward about this. You know what I mean? All right, let's do the next one, man. That was badass. This person makes me a little bit, uh, I, I don't like this kid. See, that's why I don't like him. That's why I don't like, see, that's, see, I... That's why I don't... I, I knew it, man. I... Yep. There it is. That's why I don't like his ass. I, man, I take that... We're throwing him off the edge. Ray, girl, Von Hydras. Your senses are sharp, young one. Oh, I thought they were on the same side. Never mind. Uh, I'm Ray, girl, Von Hydras. Luglist of the 7th Legion. And it would seem the damnable woman and her accomplice have led me to a married dance to the thicket of this infernal island's defenses. To think that I pursued them. I shall withdraw from now. Lesson learned.
I doubt it. You Garleans never learn. You covered the means to enslave primals, but in your headlong dash to control that which you don't understand, you show less wisdom than the very beast tribes that summon them. Wait, damn. This Inanna's member really fucking is willing- he's willing to fucking go the mile. I have no interest in crossing braids with children. Live, grow strong, and mayhap one day you will warrant my attention. Okay. Okay, that's fine to me. That's good with me, dude. Dude, we're just killing him, man. Just beat his ass. It's no big deal. I expected for a second it was about to play the victory music. What the hell is this? I looked back and you weren't there. Did something happen? Nothing of consequence. I mistook a ship. Why are you lying, you stupid ass little kid? Why the hell- why the fuck you lying? Why the fuck you gonna lie to me? Just what are you hiding beneath that mask of yours? Hmm. A longing for hope, an appetite for power, a lingering sense of regret. And I do detect a desire to test your strength against a certain hero. Is that what your gifts tell you? That's obvious. No, these are just wild guesses, but I wonder if some of my words didn't strike close to the mark. Oh, getting called out. Getting called out. Or mayhap more than a few. This is a performance then, a ruse to uncover my true nature. I see I shall have to keep my wits about me. Can we please stall him off the edge now? Why, why is he sitting there wearing a fucking mask? Like, what's he doing wearing a fucking mask like that for no goddamn motherfucking reason? Know, however, the two icons which remain are, are thought equal in might to Sephiroth, and yet might exceed him. Uh, ere though proceed, I would counsel thee to marshal thy strength and give careful thought to thy preparation. Assuming the Garleans effort afford us the luxury of time, even now thy grasp to the means to dominate primals, bind to the technology's potential for calamity. My master taught me that the entity known as Sephiroth was the world's first sacred tree, elevated to godhood by the beliefs of its worshippers. There is no power more fearsome than that born of unconditional faith and unbending ideal. This plane your master found in a willing student. Tell me, was it he who taught you of the Allegan's technology's potential for calamity, or are those your own words? "'Twas but a figure of speech, nothing more. When we last met, I caught a glimpse of the boy behind a mask, but it would seem that your defenses are firmly back in place. Must you persist with this infuriating veil of secrecy? I, for one, would very much like to know who this master of yours is, among other things. So long as our purposes align, what matter my affliction? It matters a great deal. I do not ask out of idle curiosity. If we were to fight as comrades, we need to be able to trust each other. On which note, I should apologize for my earlier trickery. It was merely an attempt to get to the heart of an enigmatic conversation. An enigmatic uh, companion, excuse me. Uh, truth be told, I was rather glad that you reacted as you did. No person of your age has any business being calm and aloof all the time, much as you might wish, be, wish to be. Anyways, we had best be off. Do send word that there are any further developments. Bye! The fuck out of here. The fuck out of here. The fuck out of here. I'm troubled, Warrior of Light. The 7th Legion will not soon surrender its pursuit of Allegan technology. While it's true that the 7th Legion uh, suffered heavy losses in the attempting to breach Alasla's defenses, the Legion is very much a force to be reckoned with. Left to his own devices, it will not be long until the Legolas moves to. <laughs> Pray excuse the interruption, but this is a call the Link Pearl. can only come from one of your fellow scions. Archon Yashlata, what have you what have, what have news you have? And you're quite certain they've broken through. Yes, of course, we'll leave you immediately. It would seem that what I feared most has come to pass. The Garleans have succeeded in dispelling the barrier, uber danger placed upon the entrance to the research facility. We must intercept and destroy them before they acquire the means to control primal entities. Archon Yashlata requests that we assemble at the scene of the intrusion. Pray depart at once. All right, boys. All right, here we go. Let's try it out. Let's see how this is going to go. We got to fight the next boss. Okay, so what do I do? Do I click on this? Oh, Fate of the Stars. Here we go. Alright. Oh, shit. The Garleans strike at the heart of the facility. Uh... What the fuck? Okay, alright, let's pull these guys. Uh, I guess I should put on tank stance, right? Make it easier for myself. So, I guess we go up here and we just have to find the Legolas. Hopefully we kill this guy. I think this guy's honestly, like, he's just scuffed Gaius Von Baldsar. Okay, uh, 7th Legion Colossus. Alright, I'm gonna try to kill it as fast as I can. 
Here we go. Big dick damage. Massive big dick damage. I already fucked up everything. Okay, um, and now he's dead. Quickly inside the barrier. No, I'm not going inside the barrier. I won't die. I won't die. Big dick. No, I'm not gonna- yeah, I just take- I take the hit, it's not a big deal. I'm a tank. After the Legolas. Where's he at? Just run the other way. What the hell are you doing? Just get the fuck out of the other way. And they still come, I see that. Alright, here we go. Let's do it. Press on, Asmongold. I will handle this. Uh, okay. Yeah, sure. That's good with me. Is she gonna do everything for me? <sighs> I have exposed the, bo exposed the bones of their work. Now to extract the marrow. That's savage. What the fuck? Oh, shit. What's up, bitch? What's up, stupid ass little bitch? Even in the moment of my triumph, you persist in your misguided crusade. So be it! I shall present my prize to the Emperor alongside your head. What pussy ass weapon is he gonna- Oh, dude, my sword's way bigger. <laughs> this is gonna be a joke. Gun sword? Yeah, yeah, watch this. Savages. Okay. Savages. Shut up, bitch. Get the fuck out of here. I don't have time for you. I'm not gonna do any mechanics. You think I? You think I pay fifteen dollars a month to do mechanics? Fuck you. I'm attacking right into it. I don't give a fuck. Let's go. Doesn't matter. I'm a can tank. You this? Yeah, I can. Wait, what the hell is he doing? My weapons inhibitors exist for a reason. I will not lose to you again. Wait, what? What? What, he summoned... He summoned the eye of the tiger. Um, was to stun it, maybe? Uh... Uh... I can't interrupt it. Enough. What the hell is he doing? Okay. Oh damn! Oh, he got his ass beat. That's what it was. It's like that uh, thing in Thor, Dan. What's up, Asmongold? Yeah. What up? Let's cut his head off. The tomb with is unbreached then. I swear to God, if we let this piece of shit go again, I'm gonna be so mad. No. Uh uh. Nope. Oh shit. Creel! I can't imagine anything more scary than a kid with an anonymous mask on and. A gnome. My wounds will not slow my blade. You should seek to bar my path. And you would slay me, no doubt it, but it would be your final act. Uh-oh. Can anybody explain to me why it's not a good idea to just immediately kill this guy right now? Like, why is it- why is it a bad idea to do that? You're kind? Yeah, sure. What madness afflicts your Eurasian fuels? The Emperor but desires a means to shackle the icons into destructive appetites. Why do you rail against your own salvation? It is not for man to wield such power. The primal energy your Emperor seeks to contain, it will be his kindling, uh, waiting for a spark. The star's fate is too important to be sided by any one man, a warmongering savage, least of all. Have care, boy. You speak of my Emperor. But dying here in defense of his honor would not further his cause. What the fuck? A flashlight? 
Well, well, well. I appear to not be dead. Um, ow. Wait, what? Creel. I may have crapped the rig. Uh, a rib. Uh, but I'll be fine, honestly. How'd she break a rib? She's just standing there. My foes gave no quarters. Had Urakai not stinted, uh, stinted in defensivity, now my certain your hurts may be far worse. I could do no less. Mistress Creel is here at my behest, after all. Urakai. I appreciated you staying at my side. Thank you. Aww. Aww. It was nothing. What the hell? Well, I don't know what the mask is for, man. We gotta find out what this mask- Why he's wearing a fucking mask. Damn. Okay. Well, fuck yeah. We got that one done. There we go. Now what? Because he ugly? <laughs> Ah, Uber Danger, are the new wards ready in place? Nope. My colleagues have yet toil upon their enchantments. I come into the inn secret that I might question the outside of their hearing. Question me? Aye. I would speak to the one who had undid my subtest magecraft. He who invited Imperial Legless into this facility in hopes of engineering the man's demise at the hands of the Warrior of Light. You accuse me of masterminding this day's events? Hell yeah, little bitch. The plan may have been thy master's, but thy deed was thine. Thou didst lure the legless of the Seventh Legion into a trap in which he was not intended to emerge. Tis plain to me now that thy seem for, uh, seeming opportunism in proposing his elimination was feigned, and that his death was the object of the plan from the beginning. True, it was a trap. Assuming these accusations have merit, what then? I take no issue with the purpose, but the method I would call into question. In the Garlean Empire, we have a common foe. Hast thou, uh, hast thou deigned to share thy intentions with Asmongold and Mistress Creel, tis like we would have closed the trap with less risk of life and more chance of success. My sincerest apologies, Asmongold. Uber Danger is correct in his suspicions. It was I who orchestrated this encounter with the Empire. I would ask that you forgive Arakai and his transgression and keep the mention of this from, from Mistress Creel. It would be a pity for one foolish decision to wither their budding camaraderie ere that had a chance to bloom. Oh, look who it is. There you are, you rotten idler. When the Ashlata realized that we were struggling with the wards alone, she was absolutely livid. Uh, never mind the warring triad. I have awoken Ark and Yashlata's tempestuous wrath. In supplicant mood, I shall return at once and be there to atone for my insolence. Okay. Come, Asmongold. It's time that we return to the Rising Stones. Warrior of Light, uh, it, if this world is to survive, we must needs be more forward with our plan. Another pillar of the Warring Triad must be toppled. Uh, the question of which has been already answered. Following our encounter with the Legolas, Archon Yashlata detected erratic etheric white life forms emanating from the sector containing the icon Sophia, known simply as the Goddess in former times. Such readings can only mean one thing. She is close to awakening. Let us return to Alislaw forthwith and put an end to this primal deity, lest she rise again in all of her terrible glory. Oh, shit. Asmogold, Urukai. the hell is this? Oh, no! Oh, no! Come save us! We're under attack! Yashlada and Uber Danger have engaged a foe from not far from here. That was stupid. What the hell are they doing? Oh, shit. Wait, what the fuck is it? What the fuck? Rarely is my shear thus tested. To it seem the Allegans have not been lax in their recruitment. Yo, this guy looks badass. Yeah, he's got some nice-ass fucking armor. You think so? Mayhap your arm merely withered while you lay idle. Oh. Still your tongues. We've stalled them long enough. They have Super Saiyan hair. Okay, um, with scales in hand, goddess shall arise and righteously cast off her, cur uh, her cursed pall that she, with wrathful worm king at her side, may judge, thence all bring balance to all. Hear my words in despair, Allegans. Our goddess is awoken. Your civilization has birthed the instruments of its own undoing. Well, shit. We're going to pop the fuck off right here. We're going to blow this boss the fuck up. We're gonna do what we need to do. Oh shit. 
What the fuck? Oh. I leave the goddess in your capable hands. Just watch out for her worshippers. Simps. Wow. Alrighty, boys. Let's go. Wait. Wait, what? There's two of them? How the fuck does this work? Well, I have no idea how this works, so we're gonna find out really fucking soon, aren't we? The unenlightened come. Yeah, right. Okay. She's getting fucking destroyed. Let me turn her a little bit more. Okay, getting out of that. Okay, thunder. Oh, we have to move in. All right, got it. Easy to understand that. Okay, now what? It's two mechanics. That's not that hard at all. What's she doing? Okay, Quasar, what does this do? You, know you, the full of death. you have to move out of that. Okay, there we go. Good job. Boar Dom got his ass beat. We gotta res him. Okay, uh, maybe move away from that cast. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so she does that kind of shit. Okay, wait, what does this do? Oh, she's just back active again. All right, cool. Back on her. Easy boss, guys. Easy boss. Okay, avoiding that. Perfect. Good. Nice job, guys. Okay, she's gonna do the cast again. Middle. Oh, I thought she was gonna fucking... Uh, she's gonna charge again or something. Alright, this is simp face. Get the simp face. Get the simps, guys. Get the simps. Okay, uh, turn away from that one, I guess. I'm assuming that's how it works. Yep, there we go. Good. And let's kill that one right now. Got him. And I'll get back on this guy. Uh, I don't know if it's good or bad for me to stand on that, but I'm gonna assume it's probably bad. So I'm just gonna move off of that. Good. Moving out of that. Perfect. Yeah, I have no idea. I have no idea, boys. Absolutely destroyed. Scales of revelation. I would know the weight of your souls. Oh my god. And you bring equilibrium. Okay, um I shall tip back the balance. So uh, um Yeah, that's what I thought. That's exactly what I thought. Okay, so it shows... It's a line that tells you. That's why I moved over, dude. I was so worried. What the fuck is this boss? Okay. Sin must be balanced with suffering. Um, we group... Oh, the different... I see, I see. Okay. In. Easy, easy, easy. Easiest easy of my life. Let's go. Great job, guys. Keep it up. Very proud of you. Okay. This boss is so weird. Like, what's the head that's growing out of it? How did that fuck? Okay, um... I don't know what to do here. We go to here? That's what people are moving to. So I'm gonna assume that's it. Daughter, be the bearer of my wisdom. Oh, I see now. Okay, so I guess that's gonna do okay. Okay, sorry, I didn't know what I was doing. I get it. So she's riding her daughter. Yeah, that's uh 
usually on other websites, not this one. Um, all right, so let's keep killing him. I guess we just have to watch out for uh, the turning. Okay, avoid. Good. Dude, I bet this fight's gonna be this fight's gonna be badass on uh, ultimate. Yeah, I think this fight's really, really cool. Okay, good job. All right, so because there's two, and so you go to the one with less, right? Yeah, there we go. Dude, this boss, like, you have to count? Like, this is hard. Okay, she should be dead here. Oh, she resurrected him. God damn. Got him, boys. I see the goddess is no more. Well done. Once Creel and Urakai have joined us, we may safely depart. One thing yet puzzles me. However, did Sophia's servants come to wake from their slumber? I believe that we have the answer to that. Oh, they've been eavesdropping on us, apparently. Okay, I see how it is. Uh, we discovered the remains of a Garlean soldier in the adjacent sector of the containment facility. Just like the fool ventured too close to Sophia during the Empire's previous incursion and enthralled with his troubles. Oh, he got MC'd. I see. Another reminder, if, if there were anywhere needed, as to the incalculable threat posed by these beings. The goddess would not even have been conscious whenever she claimed the man's will. And yet, I mean, that makes sense, right? I mean, she's hot as hell. Uh, and yet his mistake granted her uh, the means to release her servants and would have resulted in her own liberation had we not been on hand to intervene. The tale teaches us that the greatest of man's creations may yet be brought low in a single act of treachery. The Allegans were fools to praise their trust in technological bondage. To shackle such beings is but to delay the inevitable. Not save their total destruction shall free us from their menace. Let us now return to the Rising Stones and consider the final step of this most needful task. Oh my god. The threat posed by the facility is far greater than you imagine, Oberdanger, and one not limited to the icons themselves. Sophia's remaining servants must be put down. Damn. No survivors, huh? Blip bloop. Warning, deactivating stasis chamber support will, si will result in subject termination. Inter -ident Wait, this guy's gonna just kill all of them? Identification to accepted. Subjects. Uh, while conducting the final sleep of Sophia's containment facilities, uh, we discovered that all of our remaining thralls had perished in their stasis chambers. Was this your... Oh, shit. So basically, this kid here literally killed everybody else that was one of her worshippers. That is insane. Uh, aye, it was. I chose to act upon the knowledge revealed in the tombstone that we recovered. The true purpose of these prisons is far more horrifying than what we first assumed. Oh my god. The Allegans were not simply preserving the icons and siphoning away their energies. They were conducting experiments in preparation for a far more ambitious project. If you recall, both the Fiend and the Goddess were imprisoned uh, within massive spherical, spherical structures. There, these spheres were prototypes which paved the way for the successful construction of the artificial celestial body. You speak of Dalamundo. Uh, it's the icons' cages were unmistakably of the same design of the Red Moon. To be plain, the research facility contains the seeds of three calamities, which might be feasibly uh, might feasibly be vi visit upon a chosen target. Eliminating one of them necessitated the destruction of the goddess's slumbering thralls, a distasteful task befitting of one to the warrior of light. Thus did I resol resolve to do the deed myself. She is not happy about it. You have made your case, and it's apparent that we were not in full possession of the facts. Nevertheless, your notion of what may or may not be expected of Asmongold is presumptuous in the extreme. When the Warrior of Light chose to join the Scions, he did so in the knowledge that he would be required to face and destroy not only the Primals, but also their fanatical servants. That which you term a distasteful task is an essential part of our calling, a burden in which every Scion is sworn to shoulder. Yeah. Bitch. I see. To be, I misjudged the depth of your resolve. Uh, Urakali has the, uh, request about the final icon of the Warring Triad. Here we go. Greetings, Warrior of Light. But one pillar of the Warring Triad remains. Zuravan, the icon known as the Demon. 
Let us make our way to Alislaw forthwith and aid the investigations. All right, let's go. Oh, shit. It is. Nay, put up your weapons and listen. The followers of Zervan have awoken, and they toil to rouse their master. The demon's worshippers yet slumbered whenever we confronted Sophia. Could the tampering of our thralls have been more widespread than what we thought? They shared a common enemy. It's not unthinkable that they would seek to free those an ally could imprison. That would make sense. Yes, yes, the cage doors are open. And while you stand here quibbling over who picked the locked, my soldiers are inside the facility risking their lives and their sanity. They have volunteered to face death to prevent Zervan's servants from walking, uh, waking him in the fullness of his power. Now, assuming you have the last understood the gravity of the situation, it's time that I rejoin them. Why are we letting him walk away every time, man? The Icon will enslave the minds of any who draw near. Yeah, exactly. Thus did I seek out those with the power to resist his influence, aid us. Wait, what? We're on the same... Are you kidding me? Aid us and mayhap my men will not perish in vain. What? that sounds great. Fuck the Empire. What's he doing? You propose an alliance. Yes. I have delved into the depths of this place and found its technology wanting. These mechanisms have failed to hold their prisoners, and such broken artifacts are unfit to behold to bring before the Emperor. Twice have you bested me in combat. Will you now lend me that strength and stand against our mutual foe? What the fuck? That's actually cool. Damn. Twas in opposing your reckless schemes that Ysail was lost to us. You expect us to simply forgive and forget all that's come before? I expect you to put aside your emotions and use your better judgment. But of course, I'm dealing with savages. You know what? I actually like this guy now. I, I thought I hated him. Turns out I don't. I think this guy's awesome. I will not stand by here and justify the death of the Ice Maiden. We pursued our ideals and you pursued yours. Such was the result. And mayhap, you might consider another point. In these endless clashes, we have all lost comrades dear to us, yet I choose to put aside past grievances and beg your champion's aid to appeal to your reason. Thou art willing to build a bridge of common purpose upon such tremendous foundations. Yes. I too am hesitant to accept this arrangement, Archeon Yashalata, but the offer has been made to the Warrior of Light and his involvement, which shall ultimately sway its outcome. I shall abide by Asmongold's decision. Let me guess, I'm going to nod. I think it's very obvious that we have to, we, we help, uh, we help the Empire. You know it, I know it, everybody knows it. Zervan must be stopped. I'm glad that I didn't just nod. Oh no. Did I upset Yashlada? Oh my god. Oh no. She, dude, she crossed her arms. Divorce, income, I... This is, oh man, I, Yashlada will remember this. Then let us be on our way. Fuck, dude, like, rip Yashlada. It's not okay. Yeah, what if this, like, fucks up, like, dialogue in the future? And she won't want to be my girlfriend. What the f- What the fuck? The demon stirs. I see that. Like a suckling babe, he feedeth upon the aether siphoned into him by his thralls. We need to deprive him of his su sustenance. And then we destroy the devices. Yeah, I mean, that's pretty fucking obvious, right? All right, dude. Let's go. It's clobbering time. Hold. Witness your soldiers. She's so hot, man. Wait, what the hell? They're killing each other. Wait, is he going to turn into one of the demons? They've turned on one another. Even half awake, Zervan corrupts and converts those who enter his aura. Oh, shit. The three of us in Asmongold or Akai, we rush in together on each disabled generator. We cannot give them a chance to rally a defense. We strike. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. All right, let's go. Actually, good guy. Yeah, I... Damn! Was that gonna fall on me? Oh shit. Okay, good job. That was me. That was the one I destroyed. Uh, come on, you can do it. You can do it, little bitch boy. God, Cervantes. 
<laughs> okay. Oh no! Oh no! Is the guy gonna save him? The Legion? Yeah, yeah. Wow. I knew it, dude. I fucking knew it. Holy shit! He not dead, is he? You saved me, why? I told you, boy. Yours is a precious gift. Yours is a gift too precious to waste. A gift the Emperor may one day have need upon in his war and these un untamable icons. Emperor of Eris, he, he raised me up from the ranks, stood against my detractors. I gladly gave my life in his service. You must finish this. Slay these leeches upon our star. Kill them all. Kill Zervan. We must needs withdraw our assault. At the cost of his very life, the Legolas hath praised open a window of opportunity. What the fuck? So just as soon as I started to like him, they killed him. Are you fucking kidding me? The second that I thought, like, ah, oh, you know what? This guy isn't that bad. Then they fucking kill him, man. That's fucked up, man. That is fucked up. Okay, he's dead. Had I only been stronger. Enough of that. There might be time to get uh, for regrets after we've rid the world of Zervan. Uh, Creel has the right of it. The demon has fallen back in a torpor for now. We must act swiftly if Regula's death is to have any meaning. And then this is me, warrior of light. Thine is, as ever, the most perilous duty. Gather thy the trusted companions and extinguish from this realm the fires of the demon himself. Okay. Yeah, sure. Yeah, I just gotta kill his ass. That's all there is to it this season. I won't even know that I'm playing the game and I'll beat him. That's how easy it's gonna be. Okay. There's been enough sacrifice for one day. We must take the chance we've been given and defeat Zervan now. Oh, shit. Okay. Okay. Alright, we gotta talk about this boss. So, uh, the way I was thinking that we would do it is I would go in and, uh, I would probably die to the first tank mechanic, and then Dom would pick up threat after I die, and then people would res me, and then I would say nice tank swap, and then Dom would probably tank the rest of the fight, and I would probably die to the next mechanic, and then you guys would kill it. Alright, let's go for it, guys. I'm ready. Pulling in three, two, one. Let's go. Big dick damage. Big dick damage, boys. Okay, he's already 96%. Okay, Flare Star. I assume that's something we have to move out of, right? Yes, it is. Wait, what the fuck? What the fuck? What happens if I go over to this one? Oh. Okay. <laughs> okay, uh, getting out of that. Can I fall off? Okay. Wait. What the fuck is this? I 
I think we messed Good it up. And evil, the war eternal. Okay, let's go. This is badass. Holy shit. That's big numbers. Holy fuck, that's a lot of damage. Alright, avoiding. Okay, so he's gonna spin over there. Good. Okay. What do these do? Oh! They're bombs. Okay, we all get together on this one. Easy. Got him. And now back on boss, right? Yeah. Back on boss. Dude, this boss is awesome. Holy shit. This is really cool. I used a cooldown, guys. Can we get some pogs in the chat? Good. Okay, avoiding this. I'm probably not going to use my buff until uh, after this is over. Okay, he's teleporting away, so he's going to do it again. Okay, I'm going to get to, like, right here. Sorry, Sammy. Wait. Good tank swap, Dom. Good tank swap. I hit the edge. Oh, I didn't realize that. Yep, good tank swap. Okay, keep it up. Um, what is this here? He turns a certain way, I'm assuming. I have to, like, not stand in front of him. Okay, stood in the fire. I didn't know. I shall rise above all. What the fuck? Bear witness to my will. What the fuck? Oh, we got ads. Okay, let's pull the ads. We'll get these guys real quick. There we go. Nice. These are easy. What the fuck? What the fuck, dude? This is dope. All right, got him. Nice job. Good. Facing away, obviously. Perfect rotations, as usual. Okay, good. There's nothing else I really have to do here. I just sit here and tank him. Oh, they already killed the other one. Fuck yeah. This one isn't really doing that much damage either. Okay, next. Pull him back over to here. Okay, Dom's got that other one too. I didn't know that was going to spawn. So might as well just like have him hold that. Good. This fight is nice, man. I like this a lot. You're doing a great job. I fucked up, but I just didn't know that could happen. Like, some of the... Uh, yeah, I just... It, it, I, I fucked up. That's all there is to it. I fucked up. Nothing else for you to say. Now what? Okay, it's a big... Hit. Did we wipe? Bow to my infallible judgment. Special snowflakes. What? Why he read? Why he read though? What the fuck? Okay, all right, let's go. In endless torment. All right, big damage. I'm just gonna go ahead and use a a, a a thing on that. There we go. Good. This is fine, guys. We're gonna be okay. Like, now all we do is burn down the boss, I'm assuming. This seems like a burn phase type, uh, type phase right now. I could be wrong, we'll see. Did he say bondage phase? Standing and shit? No, I'm not. Marked with ice. Yeah, it's not any- I'm not standing anything. Cyclical? What the fuck is that? Okay, good. Southern Cross. Oh! Okay, getting out of that. Oh, I, have to, I, I can't stand in the ice, alright. Trying to figure out how this works. Wave cannon, standing out of it. Good job, guys. Keep it up. We're doing amazing. We're the best. Guys, we're, we are the best. Wait, I have aggro. I have aggro. Okay, let's go. Alright, face him away. Ooh, Void Bunny got got right there. Yeah, that was not good. I saw what he was trying to do. Okay. See, I got it right, guys. Tanking was done properly. Okay. Good. 
Okay. Big numbers, guys. Big numbers. Hopping CD. Hopping CD. Everything's fine. No mistakes, no fuck-ups, period. Good. I think you should just die here, right? Uh, we'll see what happens. Broken seal. What does this do? Uh, looks like basically nothing. Alright, that's fine. Oh, wait, what's that? Huh. Little red so Oh, I thought we are supposed to stand in those or some shit. Right. Biting Halibardo. Infinite anguish. Oh, that's okay. Yeah, I, I don't need to worry about that. I'll just pop a CD. Who gives a fuck? Yeah, I'm taking 30% less damage right now. I'll just take zero. I'm taking zero damage. Literally zero damage. I'm ungettable. I can't get got. Oh, shit. Has my equivocation cost me this contest? Bitch. If such is my fate. Bitch ass. Bitch ass. What's up? What's up, bitch ass? Huh? Blow up. Gotcha, bitch. What's this? Incredible as always, Asmongold. Hopefully that will be the last our world sees of the likes of Zoval. Every one of the thralls have been slain for as far as we can determine. Our victory over the Warring Triad is complete. An impossible feat had, it, had we not been blessed with your cooperation. Uh, let us not forget the efforts of Regular Von Hydros and his men. Well, without their noble sacrifice, the demon would have awoken far sooner and possessed a far more formidable energies. The bodies of the fallen now accompany the survivors on the return journey to Garlemald. Tis known that the Imperials recognize no god, yet they would honor the dead in their own fashion. And whenever we next meet, our fleeting alliance will surely be forgotten. T'was an interesting exchange, nonetheless. Contrary to all expectations, the man died a hero. Witnessing the way you all leapt into danger without hesitation, it would seem that I am surrounded by heroes. And yet, my own actions were aught but heroic. I have not the qualities nor the character to stand at the Warrior of Light's side. What a curious thing to say. Are you truly concerned that you do not measure up to some arbitrary requirement? Kriel is like, even though she's a Lalafell, I like her because she always calls out bullshit. It doesn't matter who it is, it doesn't matter what's being said or anything, she will always call out bullshit. If you knew the path I walked to reach this place, then you would understand why I doubt myself so. Return to me to the Rising Stones, and I will tell you of it. Oh, thank God. Okay, we finally get to figure out what the hell this kid's been hiding, man. Yeah, she's a time and human either. Maybe she is. I have no idea. What's up, bitch? Creel just kicked the door open. Hi! I promise to tell you of my journey, of who I am. Of where I am from. The truth is, I am not of this world. What? He came from another server? I was born of a different star, a child whose power of the Echo was too feeble to save his dying world. A child who, unlike you, never became a warrior of light. Damn. We all knew we stood on the brink of- like, how does he come from another world? Like, wouldn't it be funny if, like, people from another world just look completely fucking different? They had, like, three eyes, and instead of a nose, they had a dick there, you know? Like, it, it's- yeah, it's, it's an actual stupid-ass little fucking kid, dude. When I knew- when all I knew stood in the brink of destruction, I was yet half-grown. Had I been born but a handful of years earlier, history might have written a different tale. The seeds of other heroes that had yet to fully sprout have not withered and perished. The star I failed to save is known to you as the Void. That's great. What the fuck? So I've been there. Yeah, that's the world of darkness. Exactly. Dude, that's so cool. That's fucking awesome. Yes, Sean. Though Asmongold knew not that I speak of my homeland, I explained to him before its cause of ruin. A magic was devised to contain a defeated primal's might within a stone named as the Orosite, and the energies which bled from its imperfect vessel gradually corrupted the champions who wielded it. These heroes became slaves to an insatiable hunger for Aether, eventually transforming into hideous fiends, and none who clung to the faint traces of the light were strong enough to oppose them. 
The demons next turned to each other in a war which drained the land's ether in an ever greater amount, until one day the star was suddenly swallowed in a flood of darkness. That's the world of darkness. An entire world unmade in an instant. The void sent you encounter here in this realm are the twisted remnants of once mortal beings who gnaw on what modes of life force remain. She's like, uh-uh. There's no way that's true. That's insane. As I lay dying and beaten and broken in my last failed stand, t'was my present master who found my tormented spirit and bore me away to the rift between the worlds. T'was he who introduced me to uber danger. Wait, what? Bro, what the fuck? Like... Oh my god. It's a little bit... Yeah, that, this is the, uh... This is the Assetian who seems to be, like, halfway friendly. Yeah, it's the Emissary. What the fuck? At my mentor's feet did I learn of the nature of reality, the existence of the mirrored worlds, and the eternal struggle between dark and light. Sudden and overwhelming superiority for either side will shatter the balance, and a world in question will be returned to the void by a calamity beyond imagining. What the fuck? So this guy's in a session in training? Like, this seems like a... Yeah, this is sus. As a self-appointed custodian of this balance, my master warned me that the source, the first of all worlds, slip, slips perilously close to oblivion. In what spirit did this master prefer such a warning, a benevolent gesture, or a veiled threat? To these questions and more, I do mean to coax forth answers. Yet no master his intention, no matter his intention, that Hydoin doth teeter on a knife's edge is an undeniable truth. Knowing this, what choice was given you to make? I chose to join my master and act as, in, as his instrument on the star. The tragedy that beheld, befell my home cannot be repeated, and I will see this world saved. Yet I hesitated at the most crucial moments. What right do I have to stand along the true warrior of light? Oh my god. In thine own words, thou wert called for a time, and I offer that thou swelt, dwellest overmuch on the question of what makes a hero. The search for the answer, answer leaves you paralyzed by doubt. Heed me, Master Yurikai. You do not need to believe yourself to be a hero to perform great deeds. The deed in which you earn the hero's mantle. It's the deed itself that gives you the hero's mantle. Ah, the ideals that you hold can be less important than having a faith to act upon them. Regular's loyalty to the Emperor guided his actions until the last. And though he did not see eye to eye on many things, his final deeds can be called nothing less than heroic. Personally, I find that faith in my companions allows me to act unhindered by uncertainty. Aww. Aww. I know that should I ever falter, Asmongold and the others will be there to support me, or steer me back into the right path and as needed. Aww. Dude, I'm so, uh, I see. I'm so confused now. In the days leading up to my world's destruction, I was entirely alone. I never knew what it was like to have such comrades. I cannot imagine the loneliness you have felt, but look around you now, Rakai. You're not alone anymore. Aww. Wow. This is like super sus to me though. Like, I'm gonna be honest, it really is. It's super sus to me because like, so, I'll explain it after cinematic. Welcome to the song. Oh my God, you slaughter. Oh my god, what the- what is she doing? What is she doing, man? He's a fucking- he's a double agent. I will fulfill my promise to save this world, and when I stumble, I shall be glad to have your hands there to steady me. My apologies, this is difficult for me. For long, I've spoken from behind a mask. We should all feel comfortable without speaking with such- Bro, shut the fuck up. I've never even seen your face, stupid ass bitch. You never- like, we don't even know what you look like. You got those weird ass goggles on your face. I should hope you appreciate the irony of that- 
There it is. Exactly. Fucking exactly. That's same in Uber Danger. True. Ooh. Gotcha, bitch. Ooh. We're gonna see his face? Oh man, I thought we were going. Man, what the fuck, dude? Man, what the fuck, dude? I thought we were about to. It seems very sus. So, like, Uber Danger knows, uh, he knows the guy's name. What the fuck is the guy's name? Uh, Eridibus. Or uh, Elidibus. Yeah, Elidibus. He knows that. So, how is it that they didn't even ask Uber Danger anything about the guy's master? Because it implied that Uber Danger knew what was going on. And it just kind of went, it just like went under the radar. I'm pissed, man. I'm big mad. I, I know, keep smiling all you want, but like, that's just so upsetting for me to see that. And like, now I feel like the Assetians are not as deadly as they were before. Because like, we've already disenchanted like three of them. Like, I, and, and like, we're becoming more and more powerful. We have like the disenchantment techniques, etc. But they still do want to destroy. So basically, what the story is, I, my understanding of it, right, is that Zodiac and Hydaelyn were both part of the world, and then Zodiac was banished literally to the moon, and he's trying to go back to the Earth. And, oh man, I just, I, oh my god, dude. Why, how does this work, man? Oh my god.